to create a routing, the T code is C223. There are two T code. First T code is C223. Okay. C223. Here again, whatever master data we are creating, we have to update the plant for which we are doing. And again, the material for which we are creating this laptop dash B14. Okay. Enter. Here. Control Z, control Z, material. The what is the combination? EV01. Okay, production version one. As a production EV01. Okay. okay. Simple. Then valid from. So what is valid from? Today's date. So you are creating the production version today. Or something like that. You are having already a bomb available and routing available. Now you get alternate bomb created after two days three days your bomb alternate bomb is going to be released and in advance you are making a production version so that is also possible so you can give a future date as a validate from date okay so right now i'm going with the current date today's date as a uh, what do you say here as a production version creation date and valid up to till the end of universe okay 31 12 99 we don't know okay here, there is a lot size. So I will keep lot size here 0 from 2 is 999999. What is the lot size? How it is impact? Where from it's coming? I will talk later. Okay. Now we are having alternate bomb 1. Okay. Alternate bomb. Okay. And the bomb application is also 1. Bomb application, bomb usage, production bomb you are recreating. Okay. See, but I'm taking data from the CS03. CS03. If you go to CS03, this is your laptop bomb. Bomb message is one, right? Okay. And you are an alternate bomb one, alternate bomb two, alternate bomb three. So I'm selecting alternate bomb one. Okay. Everybody clear? Yes. So yes. Simple. Now I'm going for my routing. So where is my routing? Routing is in CS03. C. C. Sorry. C. C A03. Okay. Here my routing. I will go for operation. Or I will go for directly header. So this is my group. Okay. This is one the group. So I will update the group number over here. Group of or group counter. Okay. And type is routing. So first of all, detail planning. Here I have to select N for routing. The types of routing should be saw, right? So this is a group and type here I have to select in the private. Very simple thing. What we have created, we have given the production material number for which we are creating routing at two locations, this and this. Then I'm going to give a production version one. Then I'm giving some name, production version one. Okay. Or I can say this is my classical line. Do you remember? Here we have created routing. So this is my routing one. This is my line one. Okay, which is created in 2000, year 2000, old line. Okay, so I can say old PRD LIN, old production name. This is my name of this production version. Okay, clear. Then we provided valid from valid to date. From lot size is zero, to lot size is nine 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 nine. Back. Okay, what is that? We will understand. Okay, and then group counter from this group. Okay, so we have created two routing yesterday. Alternate routing one and two. Okay, so alternate routing one, two, three. After that, I am using first routing. Okay. This group we are created for a understanding concept of group routing. So I'm not taking that, I'm taking this. You can take any one of this, okay? Whatever is the combination you want to create. Okay. So I've selected this one. Okay, then we have group counter number and types of routing. This group number is available over here. Now, once it, everything is done, okay, we can press enter button. Okay, that first. Huh. After that, we will have validation check. So we have to validate, test and validate. Okay. So we have to click on validate. We have to validate what is routing and bomb combination, whether it is valid or not. Okay. Okay. Double click on that. Then system is going to check now where is the group number is missing here. Let's copy this group number. The group number is there now. Group counter one, alternate bomb one, bomb message one. 
Okay. Now when I click on check button, system will check. Task list is exist, means your routing is correct. Available, whatever data you have done is correct routing data. And bomb is also available. The bomb is also existing and task is also existing. So the routing is not locked. The lot size is also correct. Usage is also correct. All the details which is provided are perfect. Okay. Once you close this, okay, you can see the check has become green. Okay. And here also you can see the green check is become green. And we are now able to save this. Now we can save this. So this is the way we can create a production version for a material. Clear, everyone? Simple? Okay. Yes, sir. Now, there is another T code by which we can create a routing. So let us go with another T code. So what we can do? MM02 is a T code. We will provide the material. Then we will directly jump to MRP4 view. Through Metal Master, also we can create a production version. In MRP4 view, there is a production version tab. See, slowly, slowly, we are understanding different, different fields of Metal Master. Okay. So, here is the production version by which we can create. Now, I will update PV02. Okay. Semi automatic line. Remember what we called to this? This is our, we created this routing in 2010, which is our custom combination, semi automatic, and we will say this line is a fully automatic, something like that. Okay. It is going to start with today's date, suppose. Okay. So we are going for new entries. We'll go for details. Uh, continue. Uh, sorry. Now uh, this is my production version two. I will go for details. Okay. Here. We have to update not size 99999. Okay, six times nine. Then we have to select routing and we have to select group. This is our group number. Let's validate. Okay, now we are going to use group counter two. Okay, second routing, right? But we are our alternate bomb and bomb message is driven one. We are not using alternate bomb two, we are using alternate bomb one only. Okay, something like that. And then we will go for check option. Check. Now task is this bomb exists, everything is correct. Okay, no issue. So far, so now we are good. And let us close this and continue. Okay, so your version is updated now. Okay, you are having PV02 is created. Clear? There are two ways. Third way is there when we are going to learn uh, process industry PPPI. At that time, we'll show you third way how to create a production version with the help of routing. Okay, from routing itself, we can create a production version. Okay. Now that is not routing; that is a recipe. But through recipe, we can create a production version. That is the third part. We will understand that later. Okay. So, are we clear up till now? How to create a production version? Everybody is clear. Yes. Okay. Yes. 